Hello everyone, Relgan here again with a CVT against Schnitzel, the top 16 GM in A Terran. This is going to be a very short video where I will show you drop play once again. This time I'm going for a hedge first into gas pool, what you see from most Zergs. And I just want to go through the start quickly. I built four circlings to deal with the Reaper, built two queens, all, all is standard, and then a lot of drones. What I do differently is I leave the drones in the gas, that way I will be able to research drop and go for a baneling nest, evolution chamber and just drop him apart. On the turn side of things we see a, a standard, this is, he might be going for hellions actually, he's going for barracks factory starport, that is standard. I'm getting drops at home as soon as I have 100 gas again and dealing with the reapers with my speed circlings and my queens. Managed to clean the reapers and now now I have 8 circlings on the map. I will drop 8 circlings over here into his main base, 4 circlings over here in the form of banelings into his natural. At around 340, 340, 330 I got the baneling nest followed by an evolution chamber to research uh, to morph my drop overlords and my drop banelings. Getting a fast fur at home, all is standard just so... Because I will need the larva production and it won't uh, feel that weird to him. In case he scouts me. Now... <coughs> excuse me. At home my creep spread is pretty lacking. I did not invest into a third queen. My main is fully drawn, my natural is fully drawn, in terms of minerals at least. And that's all I need for now. A lot of minerals. So here we see the he's getting banshees with cloak. And now, this I might need to explain. So, I drop links over here and paintings over here. The reason for that is most Terrans will have their army at the front of their base, as he does. The entire army stands here in case links attack here or attack these rocks so you can quickly dispose of them. If he wants to move out he is also there quicker. I drop links over here which means he has to move these SCVs down here and uh, he has to move his army into his main base. At the same time I drop paintings over here so while these workers transfer down here the banings will arrive just in time so, he, so they can do the maximum amount of damage. Let's see what that looks like. I see the banshees are built spores at home I think. <coughs> no, not yet though. So the links arrive here and he's a little bit scared. The banings come over here, immediately moves his entire SCVs away and he moves them back. Boom, boom, boom. That was a lot of SCV de SCVs dead. 13 SCVs killed. If you look at the army value, I'm not that far ahead, but I'm in a pretty good position. I already have my drop, I have my Baining Nest, I'm getting plus one melee upgrade, so I feel pretty good about this game right now. War circling drops. The SCVs were already weakened, so dropping there again was really good. At home I have Bane, I have my have a Spore ready to defend against the Banshees, I have Ling and Baning ready to deal with the Hellbats, and that's all I need. Now if you look on this side of things, his natural is being ravaged, he has to be careful in his main because there are overlords flying all over the place and he never knows if something is inside or not. He does have a third CC but it doesn't really help him right now. He does need the mules and the... SCVs of course, but he's just too far behind and he immediately taps out. So what we saw this game was hatch first into gas pool, got the bane, got um, link speed with the first 100 gas, overlord drop with the next 100 gas, went for a standard third CC, uh, third hatchery, got a baneling nest, an evolution chamber around 330 to 345, and then dropped eight circlings over here, dropped four banelings over here and did a lot of damage. At home I defended without a problem with my already existing queens and a spore crawler and some bane links. Hope you guys liked this short video. If you like what you saw feel free to subscribe, follow me on Twitch and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!